Hello again everyone, it's Vince Four from TradeWinds.com and this is our update for May 15th, 2017. Let's take a quick look at today's markets while equities continued their move higher. The Dow finished higher by 85 points today, while the S&P and the NASDAQ both finished at record highs. The S&P was up 11 points, while the NASDAQ gained 28, and the Russell also gained about 11 points today. Now bonds... Um, <coughs> excuse me, moved slightly lower, down about 33 cents, while gold was fairly quiet as well. Finished the day up just over two points. Now crude did much better. It was up over a full point today. Now it, it's, it's pulling back here on the futures contract uh, after the close, but you can see we had a nice gap today, firmly above that 20 period moving average. We'll see if it can remain above there in the days ahead. Um, and, uh, but you know, when you look at this for crude, it's going to get very, very interesting here because if it doesn't hold this moving average, if it trades back below, I, I think just getting below today's lows here during tomorrow's session, I, I think we'll kick off another shorting opportunity here. That's what we're really waiting for. Look at that steep, steep downward momentum on that moving average. Um, I, I think we're headed lower on crude, but we could get confirmation as early as tomorrow. Now, uh, Starbucks, I want to show you Starbucks. It may be time for a coffee refill here. Beautiful, beautiful move higher here recently. Now, when they released their last earnings report, report here, it gapped lower but bounced off that upsloping 20 and actually made back, pretty much closed that gap. Now has, has retraced nicely, but today got another nice bounce. It was up about half a point, but look at that momentum. Beautiful. If you look across the board here in higher time frames, look at the weekly. The weekly looks great. Sort of a nice rounded bottom pattern here. Back to these highs could be a setup for a cup and handle formation. Here and the monthly, you know, trend still in place. Looks like these highs at 64 are going to be the next target for Starbucks. So that is one that uh, is certainly on the radar here. Any trade above today's high here on Starbucks, which the high was 60.49. So basically, let's round it off 60.50 here. Any move above 60.50, and I think we head back to those highs, those monthly highs at 64 uh, near term okay we'll uh, we'll keep an eye on things and be back tomorrow with another report but that's about it for now enjoy the rest of your day and we will see you on our next update